Hi guys, this is Nishita and welcome back to my channel. Today is going to be a really special day because I am finally visiting my college. With all the online classes going on, I had no chance to check out my college and today we're going to be doing that. Before we begin, let me quickly thank the sponsor of today's video, Skillshare. Skillshare is an online learning community where millions of people come together to take the next step in their creative journey. Skillshare provides amazing and inspiring classes for all my fellow creative heads out there in topics like photography, web design, UI UX design, marketing and a lot more. Skillshare includes a combination of video lessons and a class project and it also provides classes to fit your schedule and skill level. The best part about this is all the classes are under 60 minutes and there are no ads. I believe every single human being on this planet has a unique creative side whether you picked up your paintbrush yesterday today or way back in school it is never late to explore your creativity and be inspired i took this class by jessica swift called the daily art practice for self-care 14 days of messages to yourself it is just a 56 minute course which integrates art making into self-care both very close to my heart this taught me how to creatively process all my emotions given our busy lives highly highly recommend this one because creativity is an integral part of my life, I have an amazing news for you guys. The first thousand subscribers who click the link in the description box below will get to have one month free trial of Skillshare. So while you're waiting, start exploring your creativity now. Hey guys, so we have finally reached the college and I'm just gonna go to the student center and see if they can provide us like a pass to visit all the main blocks here. Let's hope for the best. So unfortunately we do not have access to go inside the college but I'm just going to show you guys around a little bit. So this is one block, then we have another block here, one more here and then that's like the main block. Hey guys, since we were not allowed to go into the college, we thought we would check out the Castle Oma Castle after which our campus is named. There's a little bit of history about Castle Oma, which means house on the hill. And this is basically a romantic vision of an industrialist and this apparently has 98 rooms and it is Canada's largest house. It's like really really warm today but the view from up here is so good like you can see the CN Tower and other buildings in downtown. Hi guys, today we have our vaccine appointment. So I'm just walking towards the bus stop and then I have to reach this place called North York General Hospital where I have my vaccine appointment. Hey 
guys i had like the most embarrassing experience ever so the bus i was in suddenly changed its route and i had no idea what to do so what i did was i immediately got on in the next stop i started looking for other options like you know the next bus or something but it made no sense so i've just booked an uber and i hope i reach on time I got my first dose and I just came out of the hospital and I'm kind of contemplating if I should take the bus again or if I should just you know if I should take the cab back home but I'm feeling zero adventurous today Hey guys, so let me give you a quick vaccine update. So I got the Pfizer vaccine and I was fine for about 1 or 2 hours after getting the vaccine, but the pain started kicking in later and towards the night the pain was like too much. It was at its peak, but it slowly started subsiding in the morning and the next morning I was more or less fine. Um so that's about the vaccine and now we are headed to the library because I have nothing much to do at home so I thought why not go read or just check out the library I've already been to the library once before when I have my library card and other details and all sorted so I'm going to take you guys along let's go This is done with the library, and now I want to grab something to drink. I asked you guys a poll on Instagram if I should have matcha or boba. Matcha got maximum number of votes. Also, I've not tried matcha latte from Tim Hortons, so that is what we're going to be doing now. Now Starbucks is the next choice. That is about the vlog. I hope you guys had fun watching it. If you did, don't forget to hit that like button and let me know in the comment section below if you have more video ideas for me. I will see you in my next one. Don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and follow me on my Instagram. Bye.